हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एंड नमस्ते एवरीवन आई एम धवल सर एंड अवर टुडे टॉपिक इज योर सप्लीमेंट्री रीडर यूनिट वन दैट इज अ ट्राइम ऑफ सर्जरी पार्ट टू राइट इन अवर फर्स्ट पार्ट वी आर डिस्कस्ड अबाउट अ डॉग नेम ट्रिकी मिसेस पम्फरी हु वॉज द ओनर ऑफ ट्रिकी देन वी आर डिस्कस्ड अबाउट मिस्टर हैरियट हु इज द राइटर ऑफ द चैप्टर right he is a doctor or a vet veterinary surgeon a doctor of animal then we had discussed how tricky was overfed then we had seen that how tricky had become ill and mr harriet took tricky away with himself to his clinic for the treatment of tricky now in this unit we'll see how mr Tri uh, mr harriet treats tricky at his clinic okay so we'll discuss about how the tricky got fit and fine at mr harriet's clinic so after mr harriet takes away tricky at his clinic and over there when mr harriet and tricky reaches at his clinic right so the other dogs which were living over there or which were present at mr harriet's clinic started sniffing sniffing means to smell right so started sniffing tricky but the tricky laid motionless over there right it was very ill so it did not show any kind of interest and it laid motionless over there and so due to it the other dogs found tricky uninteresting and they left tricky and went away then uh, mr harriet observes tricky for two days and gives it a plenty of water and no food at all right so after reaching the clinic when mr harriet starts the treatment he gives tricky only water for two continuous days and not even a single piece of food too tricky right it keeps on observing and on the third day tricky showed some kind of interest and it started whimpering whimpering means a quiet crying sound right we have seen the dogs making some kind of crying sound so on the third day at the end of third day tricky started showing some interest in the surrounding and it started whimpering then on the next day or the following day when mr harriet in the morning opens the door tricky moves out quickly and it starts playing with the fellow dogs means the other companions that is the other dogs around the around him in the clinic and it starts following the other dogs and then it starts rolling itself in the garden Uh, because of its extra fat right tricky was already overfed it was very fat so due to that extra fat it was running here and there it was uh rolling itself in the garden okay on the same day the writer was present when the other dogs were given food and as usual the other dogs rushed towards their food and when they started eating hi means the uh, the high speed eating sound started coming as these dogs knew that if they did not finish their food first they might have to share their food with the other dogs right so they were uh, eating the food with very high speed and due to that some kind of sound was created and after all the dogs stopped or they finished their eating tricky went over there to one or the other bowls and he started licking one or two of them when the writer saw this he was very happy as he felt that tricky was recovering from his illness because uh, mrs pomfrey had complained to mr harriet that when he was at her place tricky had left all his interest in the food that means he didn't even eat his food which he liked the most so as now the writer saw that tricky was licking some of the bowls he understood that there is 
some recovery in the tricky and because of that he was very happy so on the next day he placed an extra bowl for the tricky so that he can also have the food right so the tricky also had the food with the other dogs and he saw that means mr harriet saw tricky jostling towards the food when he was given the food on the next day jostling means that is to push against someone while moving forward in the crowd that means all the dogs when they ran forward even tricky also tried to push the other dogs and tried to reach reach its bowl right so that was the enthusiasm again in the tricky for eating the food which shows that it was recovering itself okay since then the progress of tricky was rapid and he had no medical treatment of any kind but all day he ran about with the other dogs joining them in their friendly scrimmages scrimmages means a minor battle or fight right the so usually the dogs they keep on fighting amongst themselves so tricky also got itself involved in the scrimmages that is the minor fight or battle right tricky had become an accepted member of the gang that means the other dogs had accepted tricky and even tricky was very friendly with the other dogs right so that was a thing and because of that it was the best time for tricky as he had never experienced such kind of time in his life at mrs pomfrey's house okay then at the same time mrs pomfrey she was anxiously waiting for tricky's health updates right so she kept on calling mr harriet a dozen of times on the single day and she kept on asking about the tricky's health and upkeep and mr harriet could only tell mrs pomfrey that tricky was recovering very fast and he was becoming very healthy okay that's it what mr harriet told mrs pomfrey as always she was very much worried about the tricky's health and so she started sending dozens of eggs for tricky's strength building up and she even sent wine for enriching the tricky's blood right so all these things were sent by mrs pomfrey for tricky but which were actually consumed by the writer or the narrator and his partner and once she even sent brandy for tricky brandy is a kind of a drink alcoholic drink so mrs pomfrey sent brandy for tricky which the writer and his partner couldn't believe but they were enjoying it a lot and they were content or satisfied as they were uh, consuming or they were enjoying all these things which were actually sent for tricky and this was a kind of luxurious treat right so for them it was a kind of a treat right because of that they was they were very much happy and they enjoyed it a lot so they didn't even want to send tricky even after the fortnight but as the narrator or the writer knew that mrs pomfrey was suffering a lot in the absence of tricky so she was awaiting tricky's coming back home this thing was known to mr harriet right so uh, he called mrs pomfrey to take her dog back home so within few minutes right after mr harriet had called mrs pomfrey within few minutes a 30 feet long black shining car stood outside mr harriet's clinic right that means mrs pomfrey had come to mr harriet's clinic and the chauffeur that is the chauffeur opened the door but mrs pomfrey couldn't dare to come out of the car 
as she was very much worried as she did uh, she didn't know what might be the condition of the tricky so when the chauffeur opens the door she stays inside the car only and when mr harriet comes over there she inquires mr harriet about tricky's health and during that time her lips started trembling right as she was very much worried about tricky and she inquired her that please tell me that is tricky is tricky's health proper or not she told mr harriet that tell me the truth that is tricky's health or the condition proper or not at that time mr harriet told mrs pomfrey that tricky is absolutely fine and he even told her that you stay in the car i will bring back tricky outside so when again mr harriet goes inside the clinic or his uh, place of the garden where tricky was playing with the other dogs he saw that tricky was playing around with the other dogs and he was very happy to see that tricky had become thin strong and extremely healthy then the writer carries tricky to the front of the house and when he brings back tricky the chauffeur was still holding the door of the car and mrs pomfrey was eagerly waiting for tricky right so as mr harriet brought tricky out it saw mrs pomfrey its owner and was and it was so happy that it jumped from mr harriet's arms and ran towards mrs pomfrey and jumped into its lap then when it went into mrs pomfrey's lap it started licking mrs pomfrey's face and even it started barking and by seeing this mrs pomfrey was very happy as it could see that it its dog tricky had become like it was before so at last mr harriet went inside the house with the chauffeur and tries to help him out in bringing out all the belongings all the belongings of tricky and keeping it in his car and when the car moves away at that time mrs pomfrey leans out from the window and tears shone in her eyes shone means it is the past participle of shine that means tears were seen in her eyes as she couldn't believe the miracle what mr harriet had done and by this she was actually trying to say or she was trying to think for what mr harriet had done right and at last mrs pomfrey says that this is a triumph of surgery why does she say like this because she felt or she thought that mr harriet had done a kind of surgery on tricky and due to it the tricky had become absolutely fit and fine or healthy but in a real sense actually mr harriet had not done any kind of surgery right but it was a triumph of doctor that is the doctor's goodwill his presence of mind his love for dogs and his dedication towards his work and due to it it was a triumph that is the victory or achievement okay so that's it for today i end my lecture over here and thank you so much for watching my video and if you like my videos please share it with your friends and please press on the like button and also subscribe my channel thank you